breaking news to tell you about a tough day for our sister station, KNX News Radio. A pilot was hoping to become a traffic pilot for the station. But this morning, he was killed in a plane crash. The wreckage was found near Upland, and that's where CBS 2's Cara Finstrom is live with details. Cara? Very sad, Rick and Sharon. You can actually see the wreckage from here on the road. Let me step out of the way here. The plane crashed right near the top of the mountain, killing the pilot instantly. That is very tough terrain on the side of a steep slope. So the first crews up there this morning had to hike up for miles before they could confirm that that pilot had died. Those first responders tell us the man has not been identified, but he was in his 60s. And as you mentioned, we have learned he was on his way to train today with our news partners at KNX when this horrible crash took place. He was going to be a KNX traffic pilot. I want to give you a look now at some video that was shot here earlier this morning. That is a sheriff helicopter, which is being used right now to carry investigators and their equipment back and forth. The FAA says the Piper style plane was flying from Upland to Riverside when it was reported missing around five this morning. The fire department battalion chief said there seemed to be no fog this morning and very little is known about what could have caused the crash. Last known contact was with Ontario Airport uh, this morning on takeoff, from what we can tell. Uh, no indication that he was having any problems, any failures, or anything like that. Now it's just a waiting game for FAA and the Sheriff's Department to do their investigation and get the coroner up here. And Rick and Sharon, a very difficult investigation up there. We just spoke with someone with the fire department who says they're now using ropes and all kinds of equipment to try to stabilize that plane so they can move forward. Wow.